Hey, Lee, I'm going to talk to you directly. Um, at the end of the Hi. day, at the end of the day, your name was 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 the poster child for the for the token. The whole Hawk to a meme is used to like market it and launch it. At the end of the day, when Coffeezilla makes a video about this, you're going to be in the thumbnail. Your name's going to be in the title. Um, to what Doc or whoever the fuck was saying earlier about traditional Web two influencers coming in the space and having a bad like reputation in this space. It's for this reason exactly. It's because people enter the space like this with whoever the fuck. Basically, what I'm getting at, and and I'll wrap up here with just whoever, whoever guided you in this, or whoever directed you to do this, or gave you the advice to do this, you should fire them immediately. Hey, you well, JKA the Hawk Tour girl has just found herself in a lot of hot water, and all she had to do was maintain this squeaky clean image of this funny, happy-go-lucky character, and she could have had one hell of a career on her hands. But she's fumbled it. She's fumbled it. The, 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 the inkling of money has made this woman blind. And instead, she has decided to do a pump and dump rug pull on her fans, or seemingly, and, you know, pulled a crypto scam on everyone. So Hayley Welch, in case you don't know, obviously is the Huck to a girl. She's she went famous for that infamous clip that was like Huck to a spit on that thing. Um, she's obviously you know partnered up with Jake Paul recently to build the Talk to a podcast. It was the second most streamed podcast on the whole of Spotify in the world after Joe Rogan for a very long time, and it could still well be, but now she's. You know, she's just another crypto influencer scammer. She is up there with the likes of Logan Paul now. And that's not a good thing. So, you know, yesterday at the time of recording, she provided this video clip to her fans. My Hawk meme coin is live! So she provides this Hawk meme coin, right? She promotes it on the market and people start investing money into this. Coffeezilla retweets this and says, please do not put your money in the hock to a coin. And it also got community noted saying the update authority of this token is being uphold, uh, is holding a large proportion of the total supply. Please be cautious and verify the security details carefully, right? So it's believed that meme coins will always benefit insiders and trading bots. Don't be exit liquidity. Okay, and this is obviously the path of the meme coin. So it was created at 1605. As we can see here, it reached a market value cap of around 500 million and then fell off to around 69 million within 20 minutes. If that's not the signs of a pump and dump, then I do not know what is. Um, but it was believed, you know, that Hayley Welch and her team were holding around 97% from the reports that I've seen of the market. For this meme coin so they held a very large majority so that obviously you know indicates potential insiding traders people that knew about it before it was going to go live and also bot traders it's not a great look and again you know this is the market that we've seen created peaked fell off it's really bad um and obviously you know this whole situation doesn't look good uh as especially as people have been reporting that they have invested money into this and they're tweeting Haley Welch on Twitter and stuff being like I want a refund on this because you didn't tell us that you were holding the majority of the market right so hi Haley Welch my $35,000 that I purchased of Hawk Dollar is now at $2,000 after 10 minutes of buying ouch I'm a huge fan of Hawk Tour but you have taken my life savings I purchased your Hawk Dollar where um I purchased Hawk Dollar that you were so excited about with my whole life savings and children's college education fund as well. You didn't mention that you were going to buy 97% of the supply and sell it almost immediately to make a large profit. If I had known that information, I would not have purchased your coin. Please help me or who I can tell contact for a refund. If I do not, I will be forced to use legal action. My crypto representative will be in touch. And once again, we can see here at the very peak, this person bought Hawk Dollar for $30,000 and now they're, you know, you can see the market absolutely crash. And it's such a shame that these people have been like swindled. But they are not the only one, as there is also a video going viral at the minute of this guy who has also bought Hawk Dollar. What's up, Haley? Uh, Hawk to a girl. So I just bought your token and I'm down about 
like twenty thousand dollars right now. I'll flip it around real quick. We can take a look at this chart. So as you can see Ouch. right here, I bought the token here around like five hundred million dollar market cap, and right now it's sitting at like seventy mil. And so I was just wondering if like if I could get like a refund for this or like what the fuck is going on here because I don't know this isn't really looking the best and I kind of bought because I thought that you were going to provide a lot of utility and stuff and and this bubble maps is the most egregious thing I've ever seen in my life and so I was just just wondering like what we're going to do about this and uh, if there's like plans or something so if you could just let me and everybody else know that would be that would be super chill appreciate that see you later yeah don't expect a response my dude it looks as if she's not going to be responding in the slightest but uh people have been calling out Haley welch on community notes everywhere she is trending all over twitter right now the team and the insiders have actually been selling their tokens since launch a majority have never purchased anything and have only sold the tokens that they were given. Haley is lying and will likely have to talk to a judge about this. Ouch. She's literally rugged absolutely everyone. Um, but after the crypto scam came about, right? She, it's, well, before this, you know, she's um, she's profited of around $3 million in 24 hours. One fan invested $1.4 million and came out with $46,000. That just goes to show how bad it is. But I mean, I'm not being funny. If you're going to invest $1.4 million in a Hawk coin or Hawk to a coin, you're kind of, you, you, you're kind of being a very stupid person, really, in my honest opinion. But moving forwards there was a twitter space or x space um live feed that went around uh that featured a lot of people Haley welch doc who i believe is her manager and over here who is um the co-host of the stream but you can obviously see as well coffeezilla jumps straight in on this because he's having absolutely none of this he is the shining knight in shining armor right now and phase banks phase banks had a lot to say about this so we're going to listen to his stuff but then coffeezilla absolutely grilled and pressed Haley and doc for more information yeah please um sorry no no Haley, man. again i'm gonna talk Haley. i'm gonna talk to you directly um at the end of the okay. day at the end of the day your name was, was was the poster child for the for the token the whole hawk to a meme is used to like market it and launch it at the end of the day when coffeezilla makes a video about this you're gonna be in the thumbnail your name's gonna be in the title um to what Doc or whoever the fuck was saying earlier about traditional Web2 influencers coming in the space and having a bad like reputation in this space. It's for this reason exactly. It's because people enter the space like this with whoever the fuck. Basically what I'm getting at, and, and I'll wrap up here with just whoever, whoever guided you in this or whoever directed you to do this or gave you the advice to do this, you should fire them immediately. And um, yeah. Yeah, I just want to jump in here. Yeah, um, I'm doing and... the best I can. Thank you. Yeah, please. So, obviously, you know, it's clear that Haley's never faced this kind of level of severe scrutiny before because she did not know how to react. Every clip I've seen of this, she just does not know how to respond to any of the allegations. She doesn't know how to react to this. You know, it's quite a big thing to be told that you've literally just rug pulled, scammed your audience and been caught for it literally in 4k but like i say coffeezilla absolutely pressed these guys and i'm glad that someone is because you know for a fact that he is about to um he's about to absolutely destroy people on this i'm really happy to answer any I questions, questions. I, I have questions i'm raising my hand hey guys what coffeezilla hey uh hey, this is one of the most miserable horrible launches i've ever seen in my life okay then I've why the fuck are you on i've been tracing it on chain for a while you guys generated over a million dollars in fees while y'all's fans got rug pulled there was snipers but there was also insider trading directly linked to y'all's creator account what are you guys doing obviously the second that you hear that right like insider trading linked to their accounts there's the, the, like the evidence is there hook line and sinker these guys have been, literally been caught in 4k and now they're trying to worm the, and listen you, when you hear the response that these guys have you see how truly bad this is no 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 that's that's not true 
That's that is true. true. That's a fact. No, it's, not, it's not. Well, it's, not. it's a fact, and you can see it on chain. So uh, yeah, uh, we we know. We we trust me. We we were there. Um, we could we could answer that. Uh, you no, know about so, the insider trading? No, there's no insider trading. That's why we can answer it. Okay, uh, so there's the tokens Zilla, going just, directly from the main account. Coffeezilla, just just chill for a second. And, and then it's just, getting sold a, for 50k. Who is that? That's, no, definitely not us. You think we're doing this for 50k? Yeah, fucking right. Talk to the wrong guy. You're used to these bullshit scammers out here. Not us. Now we have. That's what everyone have, says, by the way. Listen, everyone listen. Doesn't matter. Me. No, no, I'm not everyone. There was a strategic <laughs> allocation, right, oh through a foundation. Every single one of those was signed through a SAFT. The deployer wallet. You've heard of a, you know, strategic allocation or. A How much sale. did y'all get doing a pre-sale? How much did y'all make? It's not that we made. Your fans. So oh, over here, can you get on your fans. Hold on, Coffeezilla, take a chill pill, brother. You're, you're, yeah, this, so y'all just be, rug pulled a bunch of people. No, no, there's talking? no rug. We're here every single day. There's no rug pulled, not, and it's not done by us. Yes, yeah, snipers. It's actually audacious that you know they've just pulled this rug pull, this pump and dump, being caught for it, get you know held accountable for it. And then they're like, take a chill pill. And then this guy, like, Coffeezilla is well within his rights to fly off the handle there and be like, what do you mean take a chill pill? You've just rug pulled everyone. Sniped it up to an insane market. No, cap no, it's not just it. sniper. That was not it's us. Not that was, that. listen, you know that. listen, no, 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 I'm telling you the truth. And y'all made millions on fees from I, this little scheme. There's not a, oh, I'm not, sure that's not, not you scheme. getting that, those fees, it's right? Not a Who's scheme. making the money it's on the a, fees? It's Who's making millions of dollars on fees from this rug that's, pull? That's not a scheme. That's that's the pro. Who's that's the project. Fees? So we can la keep this thing going for 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 years. Okay. That's how do you think? There's so many expenses. Who makes right? the money on the fees? Someone just made over a million dollars on fees. Who made it? First of all, the fees were there with Meteora pools, and that goes to yes, the creator, right? Who's Which gonna, is who? who who, who who does that which, who belong who that who does that belong to? That belongs to the project, right? Who's the project? That, who is the that, project? Well, the project is over here, Haley Welch, right? And, and how much does Haley Welch own? Oh God, ha this is Haley Welch's project. So and, she owns all of it. Zilla. Coffeezilla. Did she chill, just make a million dollars pill. on fees take on a rug? Do, do, do you know? Do you the thing is, is he's not obviously not answering the question. He's trying to word his way around the question so that he and picking at minor things and then being like, Coffeezilla, you need to chill. Like, Coffeezilla's asking just a simple yes or no question. Who is the project? Who has the majority shares? And then he even goes, does Haley have the majority shares? And he, instead of being like yes or no and answering the question, he's like wording his way around it. You know how? Do you know how how much it costs for lawyer fees uh, to create a foundation in the Cayman Islands to hire directors? You think this stuff pays for itself, right? We're, we've. So y'all wanted to make the money on day one. I don't understand. I'm just asking. We're who here every single day. Billions of dollars day one, fees from the day two, day three. You know, this is how you run a project forever is you is you have to fund that. How and for, first of all, over here can speak to the extensive amount of work and time and people that are on this project over here has around 18 people working working on this right now as we speak. This is not a small time type of 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 nothing. We, we've we're really trying to do something here and not just do it for one day and di do it for two days like you're so used who to. made the money you haven't answered the question who made the money how much did Haley Welsh make of that million one point eight million it's, it's, two, it's, it's a foundation that is running this project how okay? much does she own of it it's a foundation she owns zero of the foundation so y'all made foundation the money? No, I, I don't own the foundation either. A foundation in Brother, the Cayman Islands. Brother, who profited? A, over a million dollars was just I'm made. I'm telling you, a foundation that pays people out. And by the way, Coffeezilla, I'm not asking you, uh, you know, questions that have that are irrelevant to the most important stuff that you said. Who cares where fees go? It goes to bills. It well, goes when to you're attorneys. charging 15 it goes to accounts. It goes to directors. You're charging it goes to staff. Of the rug pull right? and you're profiting from the There's rug no pool. There's no rug pool irrelevant. because we didn't we didn't pull a rug. I don't know what you're trying to say. It's not true. Yeah, that's defamation. Doc, you're do, do, do the math. Do it's the math. The fact that he's now going for the defamation route as well to like kind of scare and intimidate Coffeezilla is actually embarrassing. Defamation. You're saying that we pulled the rug. There was no rug pull. You released 3%. You're, 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 you're defaming our care. You're, you're you're, not, it's, are you not going to let
You it's just bullshit. talk over me. You talk over no, me. I, I'm hearing bullshit. So why? No, why you're not. You're talking over me. Let me just lay out your tokenomics. You guys release three percent to the Meteora pool, while you have seventeen percent of the token allocation unlocked day one, on from your strategic allocation. Are you guys insane? What do you guys think exactly is going to happen when your uh, insiders get sent their tokens? And by the way, who made the money from your 17% pre-sale while you're giving a tiny piece of the pie to the public? Like, what the hell? This is the worst tokenomics I've ever seen, and it is a scam. It's not a scam. Ouch. The tokenomics yeah. are a scam. That's my opinion. You can say whatever you want about it. You can cry defamation. That's my opinion. It's a scam. Good. It's it's bad, isn't it? It is really bad. Um, and like I say, right, all... Hayley Welch had to do was just keep this squeaky clean image, right? Yeah, people didn't like her because she came out of nowhere. She came off the back of a meme and people don't like instant success. You know, they think it's not deserved. They don't deserve that instant love and recognition. She had a good career going for her, partnering up with Jake Paul to get a podcast, being the second most streamed podcast on the planet at one point, you know, only behind Joe Rogan, which is one hell of a feat. And then, you know, doing this, that and the other, and she had everything going her way. Everything was going her way. And then, for whatever reason, these influencers catch a sniff of cash. And they're like, ah, that's what I need to do. That's what every other popular influencer's done. I'm going to join the likes of Logan Paul now. And I'm going to go and rug pull my audience. Such a shame. Such a shame. She's just one of them. Let me know your guys' thoughts and opinion on this down in the comments below. While you're down there, jump together, hell out that like button, subscribe if you're new, and until next time, I'll speak to you later. Keep an eye out on uh, Coffeezilla's channel, by the way. I'm sure there'll be an update very soon. I'll speak to you later. Peace.